too. There's. Low area, and there's a lot of hemlocks and rhododendrons, and uh, a lot of moisture and a lot of decaying logs. And I can just smell all of that. It's a very hemlocky kind of smell. You don't really smell that in the dead of winter, only when it starts to warm up. This is Fall Branch Falls, a really nice waterfall that I didn't even know was here. go back to where I parked, which is what I'm going to do tomorrow after I get back to this point. Right now I'm going to head toward Grand Gap Loop, which is 1.9 miles from here. Wow, this is really cool. There's a huge rock shelter here. I didn't know this was coming. Just turned a corner and here it is. a little more than a rock shelter there's actually a cave in here not a deep one but there is a cave wow yeah I, I didn't really know what to expect on this trail and there has been so much more already than I expected look at this Watch your step. getting warm there's the gorge of the big south fork somewhere down there the river is running there's a really nice campsite here actually there are a couple of them I'm gonna keep this in mind in case I have to come back to find a place to camp 
The only thing I don't like is that over in that area, I see some mountain house bags that somebody tossed, and uh, I'm assuming a bear got into them. They're all torn apart. So, not thrilled about camping at a site where a bear has eaten food at least once in the past, but this is a possibility. Is that bear fur? Yeah, I think it is. Oh, well, there's why you might want to walk your bike. So you don't go plummeting. I made it. This is Angel Falls Overlook. Now there's no actual waterfall here. Angel Falls is a set of rapids. I'm assuming it's the set of rapids right down there that I can hear. That must be Angel Falls. falls in the sense that if you go over that in a kayak or a canoe, you're going to fall out. Beautiful. Just beautiful. There's even some water in the rocks. There's rainwater that's collected up here that I might drink later. I am not above that. Just behind the overlook, there's this barely trail. It almost looks like nothing. It looks like where water has just washed down from up high. Uh, and that's what I thought it was because a lot of the trails washed out from all the rain lately. But I followed it hoping maybe there would be a flat spot up there. And boy, did I get rewarded. There is an awesome campsite up there. Look at this. Here's the campsite. Look at this. This is a view of the river. You can hear the river. And now... I finished the backtracking portion of the day's hike, and now I'm back on the John Linton Farm Loop. I'm finishing the... Hear that pileated woodpecker. I'm finishing the loop that I started yesterday. It's another great day to be outside. It's another mild day. There's none of that winter bite in the air. There's this hint of spring, this kind of... Uh, this kind of mild, gentle hint of warmth in the air, and it's very welcome. Can't have a farm trail without a farm. Here's a sign of spring. These daffodils are just about... I 
Thank you, John Litton.